everyone, this is Pink Beauty Fox 06 here, a.k. Ashley. So welcome to my channel. If you're new, if you like this video, give a like button or push that like button. Sorry, can't talk apparently. <laughs> and if you're new, you can subscribe, push that subscribe button down below. So this video is my official first video on my 365 day vlog challenge. Wow, that's a mouthful to say. <laughs> so in this video, I am just going to go over my hopes and dreams and what I hope to accomplish within this year. But before I get into that, if you didn't see on my Facebook page, which I'll put the link down below along with my other social media as well, that basically what I'm going to be doing is every day from January 1st to December 31st, um, I will be doing a video, a vlog, of either questions I'm going to answer that I've come up with, or maybe you come up with if you put them down below that you want me to talk about, or just things happening in my day. It's going to be, I won't lie, kind of random. I did write some, you know, ideas down, but it's nothing like set in stone. I just want it to flow naturally. Really? I don't know, there's so many things I want to accomplish, from small things to maybe big things. You know, every year, for the last two years, I've been writing a list, and usually sometimes I get carried away and it gets up into the hundreds of things I want to do. And, you know, some of them I still haven't accomplished, and some of them I have but maybe never stuck with. <laughs> like, for example, I you know, always want to read more, and for a while I was, you know, reading, like I got into a book series, and I was reading, and then after a while, as always, I kind of drifted off. I've never been, you know, a real bookworm, I guess you would say. Um, the reason being is I just, I get kind of tired, or, you know, all I want to do is just, you know, watch Netflix or Hulu, <laughs> and so I forget about that you know, within that relaxation that I could, you know, read a good book. I'm not saying like my parents never wanted me to read when I was a kid. It just didn't fascinate me as much as like movies or television, um, like other people for books. Um, like a big thing would be I would like to audition for um, one of the talent shows, uh, like The Voice or America's Got Talent, you know, every time I think about doing it, I chicken out every time. And, you know, I really have, like, a really awesome support system. Like, my husband's always tell me to go for my dreams, and he supports me 100%. And so he always tells me, if you want to do it, do it. And I'm like, okay, I'm going to do it. And then I don't. <laughs> I just, I don't know, I start doubting myself, you know, because I start watching the show, like after I, you know, that year I thought about it and I'm like, wow, I'm glad I didn't audition because there's too many good people. But, you know, my mom always said to me growing up, you don't want to look back in life and said, I should have, could have, would have, you know. I don't want to keep going, man, I wish I would have done this, and waited and waited. And some people, like Susan Boyle, you know, she waited, what was it, her 50s or 60s? Sorry, I can't remember how old she was when she had audition, I can talk, <laughs> for uh, Britain's Got Talent. And I know it's possible, and that it can happen, and everything happens for a reason, but I just, you know... I would like to try to do it now before we start having a family. I'm not saying we're having one right away, but you know, I would like to start, you know, having a family of my own, and that's another big thing I, you know, hope happens with it this year. And if it doesn't, maybe the next year, who knows? And so I will have, you know, some good moments to share. And maybe my not so good moments, you know, kind of getting on more serious topics, like deal, like how I deal with my fibromyalgia, and also anxiety and depression. I know that's like a really big thing um, that a lot of people are now starting to talk about, 
and I just want to be able to share my story um, maybe on those days how hard it can be and how maybe it will help someone feel like they're not alone if they're going through it as well um, also I hope to see my YouTube channel grow more it has more than I thought and that's really awesome so thanks for subscribing and watching I really appreciate it you're helping my dreams come true with just you know subscribing and watching my videos and I want to do more with my channel I know my channels kind of like here there everywhere but I like so many things you know it's hard for me because I see a lot of youtubers that only do gaming or they'll only do singing and they'll only do this you know a certain thing and that's fine because that targets just one audience but I guess just for me I want to be able to target you know multiple people and I just want to share everything that I love with all of you like <clears throat> you know how I love collecting things thrift shopping um, singing playing games um, or just talking about video reviews or vlogging you know talking to you all I'm hoping also with this that it will help me grow as a person you know it'd be kind of interesting I think I will you know towards the end of this whole thing I think I'll even look back to this particular video on my last one and see wow look at me here and look at me here and see you know if I have maybe grown more maybe I've stayed the same you know it'll just be like a fun full adventure and I can't wait to share it all with you guys and if there's anything like I said that you would like me to talk about or maybe suggestions for my channel that you would like to see you know please don't hesitate comment down below um, I love you know seeing you guys write something for me um, also I want to maybe incorporate more things with like my husband I, I really love you know doing videos with him as well and I just also want to say just as a note starting off with this new year if you ever hesitate about being yourself you know you're afraid that the people around you might not accept you please don't feel that way you know not everyone might not understand where you're coming from maybe because they grew up with a certain mindset been told that's not okay and they didn't break the mold and that's okay everyone has their opinion but it doesn't mean you have to follow what everyone thinks and it's taken me a long long time to really grasp onto that and sometimes I still struggle with it but you know I've gotten a lot better because you surround yourself with people who go you know what you like toys and Disney and you're a big kid at heart that's okay with me if that makes you happy I'm happy for you so just remember that have this year full of love happiness and everything will be okay even in the hard times just remember that there's always a silver lining and you will always break through the storm where you'll find a rainbow so thanks for watching guys I hope you follow me along on this new adventure for this year of 2017 like if you like this video and also subscribe so until next time guys bye